right now at the very least. Isn't this where I'm supposed to be? Or am I crazy? There's also another one of those stakes there. Also, I think I need to go to that island over there, so no. Is my answer to the thing that I just said before. I don't think I can get up this yet. So I'll come back to that. I'm gonna keep leveling up my Pokemon. I also need to catch one of these, so I should probably do that. For Pokedex sake. A Dratini. And not the Dragonair. We hit. Dratini you safeguard. Cloaked itself in a mystical veil. Leaf storm. One day. Dratini avoided the attack in slow motion dodge matrix style. Hex. Because I don't even know anymore. That was alright. Rain dance. I'm surprised it's this chunky here. It's used to be pretty good. And they've, they've fixed a few things, so I'm surprised it's this chunky here. Should be good to throw a ball at it, and then watch the ball spin in slow motion. Great ball. Actually moves somewhat fast. It's more like just less frames than slower, I guess. Although it does feel a little bit slower, just a little bit. Routini's attack rows. Speed rows. And it's no longer protected by safeguard. But that's okay because we're just trying to catch it. Go Grey Ball! Broke free. You broke the mold. Ouch. I really don't want my Pokemon to go down again. It might be because a dive ball. Because we're in the lake. One. Two. Three. Oh my goodness. Slow motion. That was so epic how slow motion that was. Cool effects for cheap. Guess that's kind of how this whole thing works. Sent to the boxes, very nice. Now we just need to evolve that one more time with the other evolution. The one that's stronger than that one that I just caught. But anyway. Oh, a Vaporeon! That's, that's pretty cool just to find that randomly. I mean, what are the chances? Uh, I guess I'll Leaf Storm it. I'm weaker than it. I'm lower leveled, so this shouldn't kill it. Yeah, that's pretty good. Probably gonna avoid using another attack, though. Although I did also just slow my special attack, so it might... I mean, I could, and it just raised its defense, but not its special defense, so I don't know. I'll throw a Dive Ball. See how that goes. I love how the throw was faster than the ball is at any other point in time. Broke out, acid armor again. Don't have any physical moves to use on it though. Dive ball. Boom! And then slow motion. <laughs> Broke out again, I almost had it. Muddy water. Rotom avoided the attack. Very nice. Dive ball. One, two, three, and caught. Nice. Another another e evolution for the Pokedex. Or oh, so I'm about to run out of boxes. I just realized that. Well, that's a problem. Especially if I need another half of the Pokemon. But I mean, I fit half of the Pokemon into the boxes that I have, so... 
That's pretty good. I guess I might have some double ups because of catching the evolved form of some of them. Let's swim faster to make this go by a little bit faster. Also, spinning. Bergmite! I don't think I've caught a Bergmite yet. I have been in Pokemon Go recently, but not in, not in this. Pretty strong. Let me see, what do I want to send out for this? I'll go Fracture. That's a lot of Bergmite, but that's about what it's been in Pokemon Go as well. So many Bergmite. Ah, uh, that's Dragon Pulse. Nice, good start. Berg might use Takedown. Damage itself with the recoil. So now should be a good time to throw a Dive Ball. I should probably be saving these Dive Balls for something more important. But I mean, I have to catch everything anyway, so... Three... And caught, nice. I can even get the evolved form of Bergmite here. Let's learn Outage. Oh, Outrage. That one. Which is a dragon type move with 120 power. The user rampages and attacks for two to three turns. The user then becomes confused. Interesting. It's risky. Breaking swipe lowers their attack stat. I'm tempted to get rid of Dragon Pulse for this, possibly. Although I could also get rid of Dragon Claw, so... I might just get rid of Dragon Claw because it doesn't have any special effects. I mean, neither does Dragon Pulse, so... And I guess it would make sense to replace a physical move with a physical move. So let's do that. Okay. Very nice. Bergmite. The Ice Chunk Pokemon. It's an Ice type. And it's amazing. <laughs> because it's Bergmite. You know, that's all it needs to be. Okay, let me just heal you quickly. Let's catch the Evolve form. We're getting slowly closer to where we're supposed to be for the Titan Pokemon. But everything is slowing down, which makes it even slower. Fracture breaks the mold. Avalug. Ah, uh, it's breaking swipe you. That didn't do much, but that's okay. Avalug's attack fell. Avalug used Blizzard, which is super effective. Interesting, very interesting. So I guess ice is effective against dragon? It's a shame I don't have any ice Pokemon right now. Now, what do I want to do? I'll send out River of Room, I think. See how that goes. Poison Jab? I doubt that's going to be very effective. Have luck use Blizzard. Actually, that's probably going to be... No, we're fine, we avoided the attack. Poison Jab again. Just chip away at its health a bit. Have luck use Blizzard. River of Room avoided the attack. Getting there, do I risk doing it again? I think I will. Blizzard, it's not very effective. Poison jab. Okay, it's on the lowest health I could possibly be. Double edge, not very effective. Good. Damage by recoil. Oh, it's so low! But now is the time to catch, so let's do that. Dive ball. One, two, Three, and caught. Avalog was caught. Cool. Now I can get rid of the Bergmite, but who would want to do that? So I'm going to keep this Bergmite forever. 1,113 pounds. Okay, let's... Oh, there's also another Terra Pokemon. Over this way that I want to check out. See what it is if it's something I don't have yet. Also, did I catch the frog Pokemon or whatever it was? That was on the thing. 
Also, I definitely have you already, so I'm going to leave you alone. But it might also be good to fight you at some point. When I'm a little bit more under control. Please stop falling into the water. Why? It's fine. Let me heal my fracture. Again. I don't have any good Pokemon for this next thing, do I? Not extremely good Pokemon, at least. But I might send out Rubber of Room. Actually, no, I should send out... Uh, what's it called? Gardevoir. Let's do that. Okay, we're here. There's a trainer here. What's that? These Pokemon are just here? Sunshi! Are they not supposed to be here, or...? I don't know, let's do, use Dazzling Gleam, though. Get some XP from this fight, at the very least. Memento. Got a voice attack, harshly fell. And special attack harshly fell, that's okay. It fainted, so we're good. So there's a lot of Pokemon here, which makes me think that they... I don't know. Also, I'm guessing that this means that the Pokemon's not here and I have to look for it elsewhere. You might be wandering around. Which makes me very concerned that it's just under the water somewhere. Wow, all the way out there? You sure put in some effort, coming all the way out here on your own little legs. Okay. Cabby Oscar. Might be in trouble with this, possibly. Doesn't gleam. I don't think that's effective. It's not very effective at all. Use Dig. Ah, now's the time to switch out Pokemon then. Oh, if I have Earthquake when it's under the ground, I mean, I'm gonna have to wait a turn, but still, it could be super satisfying to pull that off. In a turn or two. Which it has to be, so. Um, mud shot, I don't know. Super effective. We can definitely beat it on the next turn. Oh my goodness, yes we can. Ah, oh, beautiful. Okay. Earthquake does double damage when the opponent has used Dig. And it's super effective, so of course it is as a strong move to begin with. So yeah, that crushed it. That's super satisfying. <laughs> super satisfying to pull that off. Those little legs hold up some real great skills. Thank you. Now to go find this Pokemon, wherever it is. In the lake. Right here. No? I thought cutting was activating. But I guess not. Now if I was... A Titan Pokemon, where would I be? I mean, probably out in the open somewhere. Like, where there's lo lots of water. But we've already checked on the other side, so I don't know if it's gonna be over here. Or something, or maybe it's behind the waterfall? I don't even know. But it's fine. What is this Pokemon? It isn't. That's the answer. This Pokemon isn't. It's that kind of Pokemon where it isn't. I can hear it, but I can't see it. More well, Pokemon just on the shoreline, I guess. I should check the island over this way. Because I think that's the obvious thing that it wants me to do. Is you go to the island, there's nothing there, so go to somewhere else. One of these islands. Or something. That was a strong one. It's a shame. So do we have Venomoth? That's my question. I don't think we do. Also looks like there's another Terra-type Pokemon out on the water again. There are so many of those around here. Also we have caught this before, so let me just take this out then. Super effective. Must have caught a Venonat earlier and then evolved it. Even though I don't remember. It was probably a while ago. Just gonna run. Send you out instead. Of battling manually. 
A lot of Pokemon here. Do I have a Sword Blue? I can't remember any of the Pokemon that I've caught, apparently. I don't know why. But it's fine. Get him. So here, a Gimmigool. Behind this rock, of course. Also got a full restore. That's pretty good. Oh, hey, another thing. Right, of course. There are so many of these stakes just around. So many. Pull out the stake. And have it crumble to dust. I assume it would crumble to dust. I don't know, though. Maybe it doesn't. Now I need to check these. Please. Please. Yeah, I have caught one of those. I have I caught one of these? The evolution. Altaria, I have not. Torch Song, hopefully that won't kill it, which probably might. Nope, that's not very effective. Interesting. Very interesting. Well, my special attack rose. Moonblast. It's not very effective. Bite. Just neutral, it, but it flinched, and it can't move. Good. Gonna bite it again. And hopefully not get a critical hit. Okay, good. Cotton Guard. Its defense rose dramatically. I think that's what that said before it vanished. We use a nest ball because we're slightly higher level than it. By seven levels. One, two, three. Caught, nice. Gotta run out of Pokemon space. Dragon flying. Incredible. Might be worth it if uh, my fracture doesn't get a second type. Possibly. So I'm a little bit concerned that there isn't going to be the Titan Pokemon here. Where's the Titan Pokemon? Where is it? <laughs> Where'd it go? Also, we can fly back to this island, which is nice. If we need that. Is that something in the water? Is that just a reflection? I think that's a reflection, but still. Maybe I need to do something else on the lake before I can actually get the thing to appear. Because there's all these uh, terror type Pokemon around. So maybe it wants me to do something with that. Can I just send you out to fight that? Probably not. No, too scary. It's fair enough. Still a little bit crunchy here. Can, can you fight the thing, please? Fight it. It's right there. Just fight it. F fight the Pokemon. It's about to fight me, so I'm in trouble. Okay, I'll fight this one then. <laughs> See how level it is? And what type it is, because it could be something else. It's a dragon type. Okay, cool. I'm in trouble. I need to switch Pokemon right away, probably. Hang on, what, what's, do I have something effective to begin with? Probably not. Intimidate, attack fell. I can hex it, but that's about it. Let me switch Pokemon. Do I guess Gardevoir? Or Fracture? Guess, uh... Dragon is effective against Dragon, probably. What level is this thing? I didn't check that. I should probably have checked that before deciding to keep battling this. Also, also this... This thing looks so cool when it's crystallized. Mold Breaker breaks the mold. I still don't know what that means exactly. Ice Fang! That's gonna be super effective. Oh, that's a shame. Uh, Outrage! Dragon Dance, I'm dead. That's a shame. Probably? No, it's, it just rose its, its attack. That's good for me. And it's speed. Outrage. Which, at least that's super effective. And it's low its health a fair amount. 
It might have broken. Oh, it just used Outrage on me. No. <laughs> no. It's super effective, dragon against dragon. Okay. I'm fine. Also, I'm surprised it didn't break it down enough. To even, like, catch it or something. I didn't mean to mash like that, but it's fine. It used Outrage and I might be in trouble. Doesn't affect God of War. Wow. Okay, nice. Psychic. Guess it's not going to do a full amount of damage anyway, so... Yeah. Has to break its Trustalization foot first, so... I wonder if it's rendering stuff underneath the water, <laughs> like the ground. Maybe that's why everything's breaking, because it's rendering double space. The water and b beneath the water. And also the reflection, all the reflections is probably help helping it everything die. Just too many things all at once. Well, nice, we got some good stuff from that. Mostly XP probably. Well, so what just happened to my screen? I saw something or like an orange box drop in the top left. I don't know if that was just my imagination or something, I don't know. But that was concerning. Fracture keeps going down. It's very sad. Did I get some... No, not that. Bag. Did I get some candies? No, I did not. Okay. So I'm gonna heal you. I still haven't found the Titan Pokemon. I don't know where it is. This is the last one, so I imagine it's gonna be somewhat different. Probably. Each one has had some sort of special thing, I think. Because the one in the sky had... Boulders. Life Orb. Boulder loses something, but gains something else. I didn't see what. Also, I don't think I've caught... The evolution form. That one. So let me grab that. If I can. Toxicroak. Start off with a Thundershock. You use Sludge Bomb. Which is super effective. Great. I don't know what to do now. But it's fine. Switching to Gardevoir. Hopefully. We'll be alright. I don't know about that, but I can try. But poison fighting is an interesting combination of things. That's also super effective. And I'm poisoned. Ah, uh, dying. In the game and real life. It doesn't affect Toxicroak. Did I do my turn? What happened? Psychic? No, doesn't gleam, that one. Okay, that was alright. It's at a better level now. Healed a bit, and I want some poison, so that balances out. I'm dying, <laughs> and I'm dead. Cool. Well, it's fine. Next Pokemon. Just pick something. Go okay, Whiskash. I don't want my Pokemon to go down, though, because I want the XP from them. Or XP for them. Let's try a Great Ball. A like Great Ball seems to match perfectly with the colors of Toxicroak as well. Somewhat perfectly? I don't know. There we go. Nice catch. Poison fighting. Very cool. Time to heal my Pokemon again. Do 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 do. It's a never-ending cycle. I'm possibly on the level, like, I'm probably at the levels that I'm supposed to be at by the time I get here, so that's probably part of the reason why I'm struggling so much to keep my Pokemon alive. Well, I guess I'll go to another other island. And maybe I'll find the Titan Pokemon one day. Another Terra-type Pokemon there. There's so many Terra-type. It's just in this one area. This is probably the most open without too many items to collect area. I 
Here a gimme ghoul. Got an ether. There's a gimme ghoul. On top of the rock. Oh, hello. I'm just gonna bounce off of you, I guess. Just gonna send out my Pokemon to fight you. Just a little bit. Just switch them around, please. Why is B not working? I don't know. Are you not gonna get him? Do you have to have ground to walk away from me? To wander away? I guess so. Try something else then. Go to River Room. Okay, fine. Just get beat up then. I'm assuming Fracture is also not going to work. Yeah, that's really weird. That that works like that. How about I understand why? Nice. One. Two. Three. This is how you're supposed to grind. Four. Just getting all these Pokemon all at once. One go. Wow, you really wanted to fight me. That was impressive. Where's the Terra type Pokemon there? Just another Slowbro. I think whatever their evolution is. And it is a grass type. Well, that's a shame for me because I'm not set for that. Currently. A switch in Skull Dirge. Although it does know water type moves, so it might be in trouble as well. That's what makes the Terra types so interesting. Is there a different type, but they are... They still have the, the moves that they would normally have. Select so off. Meaning... Its HP is f full. Okay. Torch Song. Nice. Very nice. Critical hit. Skill Dirge's special attack rose. Now it's back to its regular type, unfortunately. So let's use Bite instead, because that's also super effective. And there we go. Good stuff. Okay. I still haven't found the Titan Pokemon, but I feel like it's gonna be behind a waterfall or something. Maybe. Well, maybe I do have to fight all these Terra-type Pokemon. Oh, you're cool. Azumarill. With a type of Fairy, I think. Question is, is Dark effective? Or, okay, never mind, I'm not the other Pokemon. I, I forgot which Pokemon I am. That wasn't very good. Okay. <laughs> Too underleveled. Might need to switch Pokemon out for this. Uh, I guess Poison and Steel is the best that I have to work with. Go River Vroom. Poison Jab. Hopefully this will do a lot of damage because I'm not going to die otherwise. Not quite enough, I don't think. Sing. River Vroom avoided the attack. Very nice. Poison Jab again. Aqua Jet. Still holding strong. There we go. Now we just need to finish it off. Ok, 
Okay. Oh, it's also poisoned. It's almost, almost, almost done by itself. I could heal this turn, but I'm not gonna. I should have healed this turn. It's fine. We're still alive. Still a bit crunchy. But there we go. Something wants to learn Fire Blast. Skull Dodge wants to learn Fire Blast. That's pretty cool. 110 power, not 85 accuracy. It's a special move. Target is attacked with an intense blast of all-consuming fire. This may also leave the target with burn, so it's definitely worth replacing Will-O-Wisp with that probably, because I haven't been using Will-O-Wisp, so... Having Fire Blast is a powerful move as well as a possible way to inflict burn, so... Let's do that. Getting a lot of LP from fighting those, uh... Terra-type Pokemon as well, which is pretty good. But anyway, I think that's probably it for now. So thank you all for watching. I'll see you all next time. This lake is so peaceful.